everyone, my name is Tutti Del Monte and I am a photographer for Boudoir by Tutti. Uh, today I'm going to guide you through and show you some of my favorite all black options in terms of what to wear for a photo shoot. So get ready to have some fun with these. Mm -hmm. So let's start by a basic two-piece set, black bra and black underwear. So this could be anything you have already or something you go and buy new. I chose a push-up bra because, you know, a lot of women for boudoir shoots would like to accentuate their breasts. So this is a perfectly allowed excuse to really go for either like a smaller bra if you want to buy something new to really push your boobs up or bring your push-up bra. It looks really great in photos. The next option is a little bit more playful. It's also a two-piece set. And the one I chose for this has some lace detail in the bottom and then it has like a strap detail on the top. So it sits here, has some lace on the top, straps, it doesn't have to be this exact bra obviously, but this is more of like the playful, sassy, naughty option if you would like to use that. Third two-piece option is instead of a push-up bra, I honestly really love um, no underwire type bras. This one is completely see-through over the nipple and it looks really, really great, um, especially on, in these like laying down shots that you can kind of get the detail shots of curves of the body, especially around the breast area. So now let's move into options that are a little bit less obvious, I would say, with, with lingerie. This outfit I have here is a two-piece option. This works because it's actually really, really chic and also um, covers your midsection in case that is something that you are looking for. Not necessarily only for people who are trying to cover their midsection, but I honestly really like um, a more like um, a balanced approach. Sometimes it's really nice to be covered on the top and then kind of a little bit more sassy on the bottom. Or you could do vice versa with that option as well. So here I paired a really beautiful lace underwear that has that cheeky back to it with a crop top sweater. So this is actually a, a kind of fitted crop top, but it really works. It balances out in terms of the, the full look. So now, other options in terms of add-ons. I always recommend bringing a nice pair of tall heels that really work to bring the bring you up from the top to really lengthen up that look and that um, perspective that you will be giving the camera. So here, these are honestly one of my favorite heels. They, they have these in nude black and even like a baby blue. And I got these at Target. They're actually really comfortable. They're beautiful, timeless, classic. And they work really, really well for both standing and laying down photo options. Now, I really love things like um, corsets because they bring in, the, bring in the waist in a way that is very reminiscent to the past. It's very, very ladylike, very hourglass-like. And so it adds that element of romanticism and, and classic beauty. Um, and it looks really awesome, especially when paired with a great black bra that maybe pushes your breasts up and, and it just it honestly does, it makes for really gorgeous boudoir photos. In addition to that, garters are always a great idea because they add that element of naughty that you are more than allowed to bring and include in your photos. Last but not least are hosiery. So these are thigh highs that you can add literally to any of these looks and it will look baller. Like it will look so nice because who doesn't like thigh highs? Who doesn't like hose? Seriously. These are so gorgeous, so ladylike, feminine, just show stopping. In that, I will also finish with a regular full on hose. Full coverage, sheer or opaque. This you could pair with a black bra, you could pair with a 
t-shirt, a see-through t-shirt, maybe without a bra on. You can do this with the heels, without the heels. You can do this topless. So these are great because they, to me, they are really the ultimate female symbol, really, especially when it comes to boudoir. So I always recommend having either black, nude, or thigh high, or full coverage, whatever option you find in between bring it because I think it's always a great idea. So now, where can you find all these options? I buy things anywhere from Target to, um, I look for things at thrift shops. Sometimes they have really cool vintage options that you can throw on um, and just kind of give your shoot and your entire vibe a little bit of a, an, an extra factor. I also purchase things at Century 21, Nordstrom Rack, um, and then I go brand by brand. The brands that I really love that include La Perla, they include Journal, um, La Gente Provocateur, Gooseberry Intimates. Sometimes even you can find really great pieces that work really well for shoots at places like H&M or even Forever 21. They have great options that don't break the bank and actually look really, really good. So if you are using those options with stores that are very trend heavy, I would suggest buying the classic colors at those places like black and neutrals. That way, no matter no matter the style of your photographer, you will emit the, the classic and timeless feel through your photos. So that is it for today in terms of black options for your boudoir shoot. Um, I will be posting other videos that are also very informative in terms of what to wear. So the next video I will post will be all about body suits and what they do to accentuate your body. So stay tuned. Thank you so much for watching. And if you have any questions, feel free to message me through the email or through my website, boudoirbytuti.com. 